welcome back to the channel so here we are discussing the question basilege in kakak so the problem states that ak and milo one two fellow competitive programmers decided to give basilege a problem to test his skills basilege is given three positive integers n k and x and he has to determine if he can choose k distinct integers between 1 and n such that their sum is equal to x since vasilije is now in the weirdest city in serbia where eka and milovan live kaka the problem seems weird to him so he needs your help with this problem so we have test case t which contains number of test cases i mean and n k and x the maximum element he can choose and the number of elements he can choose and the sum he has to reach so first we are given n which means maximum is 5 and he can choose three elements out of it and he has to give the sum 10 so he need to choose between 1 to 5 and need to reach 10 and can choose any three elements so in this case if we take any three then we can consider take 2 3 5 so if you add them up this sums up to 10 and hence we output yes in this case for the second case you see 5 3 3 3 so you need to choose any three elements and you need to have 3 as the sum so when you take any three suppose 1 plus 2 plus 3 this will be what greater than Three. So this is not possible. Now you take ten, ten, fifty-five. So you know that the sum of ten elements that is ten into ten plus one by two, it is fifty-five. so if we take all the 10 elements it will lead to 55 and we will output yes hence here if you see carefully what you observe is here if i am taking in case of 5 3 10 let me remove this first yeah so in case of 5 3 10 if you see you can take any three elements and you want sum as 10 now suppose i take all the elements 1 2 3 4 5 and i need to select any three so what would be the case that i would select any three to obtain my sum i would start from 3 at the last so the conclusion is that if the sum of the last three numbers becomes greater than x then i can output yes so if i add them up it will sum up to 12 and 12 is greater than 10 which was our x hence we output yes in this case now taking the example of 5 3 3 here also if you take the sum of three numbers which is 12 12 is greater than 3 but in this case we also need to check so we also need to check that the sum of the first three elements must be lesser than or equal to x so if you see the sum of first three elements which is 1 2 3 3 here is greater than x so x is
less than the sum which is here 6 because our x is 3 in this case so hence we output no so we have met two conditions so first of all we need to check the first k elements in this case it was 3 so first we check the first three elements take their sum and then we check the last three elements and take their sum if the sum of first three elements is greater than x or the sum of last three elements is less than x then we would simply output no else we would output yes so i hope you all understand the solution thanks for watching